My name is Charles Bell, and we are on the mid deck of Discovery. Well, this room we're in right now is about the size of a small bedroom. Um, once it's packed for flight, you probably have uh, 35 to 40 percent of the room that you see right now. But bear in mind that although we're confined to the floor space, they have the entire volume to work yeah. with. The galley would go up against this wall. You also have another locker next to it. In this picture, you can see the galley. Normally, we carry two spacesuits, and they're normally stowed in the airlock, which is back in that way. We would only use this airlock when we're um, performing a mission such as Hubble uh, servicing. As normally, when we dock with space station, we use the uh, uh, airlock on space station. Uh, flight deck of Discovery, OV-103, uh, commander seat, pilot seat, uh, forward flight station, and back here is the aft flight station, right back here. I started, let's see, I was out here, TDY, and um, second flight That's when I first started working on this, this one. But over the years, I've worked on all of them. It's been used, but it's... Um, uh, national treasure. Uh, what you're looking at now is the Palo Bay of Discovery. We're currently preparing it for a trip to Washington, D.C., where it'll be permanently displayed. Midbody is 60 feet long, 15 feet wide. We have three fuel cells, cost between $12.3 million each, so we handle them pretty gently. But for the last 15, 20 years, no issues at all with fuel cells. I think we worked all the kinks out of it. We could go another 20 years if they'd let us. 